Hey, can I ask you a question? Sure. What do you think the earliest is that people should be allowed to put up Christmas trees? December 1st. Okay, good answer. Uh, what are you reading? Why are you asking about Christmas trees? Uh, just curious, no reason. I lied. There is a reason. It's day 200. 200 days since the government here declared a state of emergency and all the lockdowns and quarantines began. I've declared a state of emergency in the province of Ontario. The province of Ontario announced a provincial state of emergency. Oh, no! 200 days is 4,800 hours, 288,000 minutes, and 17,280,000 seconds. Yeah! That's a lot of time for people to not be able to do the things they like to do. To see family and friends, to travel, to go off and have adventures. Come on! It's no wonder why some of these people have started losing it. I have a breathing problem. My doctor would not let me wear a mask. I don't wear a mask for the same reason I don't wear underwear. Things gotta breathe. Take off that mask. That's the only way it's gonna work is if we all you know. I will not be muzzled like a mad dog. I'm not paying for we need to improve the mood. Why don't we start Christmas early? Ooh. Decorations, presents, colored lights. If we're gonna be spending more time at home, let's make it fun. Yeah! Take a hike! Problem number one. We only have one Christmas tree at the house. I'm headed to my parents' house because they have a lot of Christmas stuff that I can steal. Let's all go to Caledonia, Ontario, Canada. Editing side note, you're gonna see that I have to blur out my mom. She doesn't like being on camera. I'm not sure if it's because she's in the witness relocation program or maybe it's something cool, like she used to be a CIA operative. I've never figured it out. Let's go. I didn't live here anymore, so I wasn't sure if I should knock or not. Oh, come on in. Yeah! Oh yeah, is this it in this big giant bag? Body bag? Yep. Here we go. Yes. Oh my God. Oh. See what we got here. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, that's great. Yes, indeed. All right, successful mission. We came here to get a Christmas tree and we got it. I'm gonna have to get this into the car now. Oh my God. It's a shelf of a bunch of old stuff. That's an original Nintendo Entertainment System. Yes, could use a good cleaning though. Found my old DVD collection. Back in the day, no clue that Netflix was gonna be a thing. What am I gonna do with all of these? Okay, I'm back from the parents' house and I got the Christmas tree. I have no idea what this sink shot's all about. Our next door neighbor is a retired cop. I hope he doesn't think I just brought in a body bag. And now it keeps spinning. Okay, we have the trees and we have the decorations. Let's get going. Oh, Christmas tree. I don't think two trees is gonna cut it. Oh, yeah. It's 2 a.m., but luckily I have a tree guy. I'm gonna go see him right now. I'm in a Walmart parking lot because this is not a hands-free device. Oh no. <laughs> Dude, you have so many trees. I'm putting them up tonight and leaving them up till things are back to normal.
This is hard work. Even as a kid, I didn't like doing the decorations. I love Christmas trees, I love the end result, but I kind of like just sitting back, watching everyone else do the work, and I just look at the pretty lights. The problem with putting up all these trees is that it made a huge mess. It's the middle of the night, so I can't run the vacuums and wake Rachel up. I'm just hoping that she's not gonna notice. Yeah, she won't notice. 2020 has been an interesting year, and considering that the world is falling apart all around us, this right here is making me feel a little bit better. I feel much better now. A lot of people have good memories and feelings when it comes to Christmas, so here's what you do. Go into your basement, your garage, your attic, your storage locker, barn, trunk, cave, pit, dungeon. Will you Who shut up, man? Listen. Get your Christmas decorations out and put them up. If you don't celebrate Christmas, it doesn't even matter. Go to Walmart or get on Amazon, order some string lights or something else that you can decorate your house with. Doesn't even have to be Christmas. How about three months of Halloween? That sounds pretty good and we'd all be wearing masks. How about an extended St. Patrick's Day? No shortage of toilet paper, just a shortage on beer and green food dye. What about three months of Valentine's Day? <laughs> that sounds horrible. Julia. Sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. <laughs> Make home fun. We're spending more time than ever there, so change things up so every day doesn't feel the exact same. Is it Tuesday? Is it Sunday? I don't even know anymore. Is this a good idea? Bad idea? Tell me down in the comments. Maybe you'll rinse me, maybe you'll think it's a great idea. I don't know. I wonder how Rachel's gonna feel about all these trees. She's probably just gonna notice the mess. This is where I put in like a graphic that says the next day. The next day. Hey, do you like the Christmas tree? Yeah. Did you look upstairs yet? No. Come with me. Oh. Well, what do you think? Well, it's a lot of trees for one room. <laughs> yeah, but do you like it? Are you gonna clean the floors? Follow the adventures of The Jeff Chase on YouTube. This sleazy guy right over here, he's a sleaze. The reviews are stellar. He's crazy. Mm doesn't appear to have basic knowledge. High praise from around the world. I think Jeff is a nice person. He's very low energy, sleepy guy. An international sensation. He embraces dictators like Kim Jong-un. A man of the people. He's the weakest mentally. He's a loose cannon. He is so shallow, you could not get your ankles wet in him. Smash the subscribe button and click the bell so you'll be notified when a new video is released. Hooray! People couldn't stand it anymore, no. If you're into all that social media garbage you can follow jeff on instagram twitter and whatever else is popular these days they can pretend to press things but nothing actually happens at the jeff chase jeff who that's J E -double -F. he's actually not that bad i've watched you on television you're a real beauty subscribe now well that was some weird shit